Hi, my name is Matthew Browns, this is my focus group. Um, here we have Tara Pringle Stacy and Callum Reeves. Okay, guys, so why do you think it's effective um, for an artist or producer to cut to the beat in music videos? Um, I think this can be seen as effective because as it cuts to the beat, it makes it more relevant to the song. The music video makes it ties in with the makes song. Makes it more relevant to like the actual music melody. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Adam Callum. Why is miming and lip syncing important for an artist in a music video? I feel miming um, gets the audience. Let's <laughs> start again. Oh. What do you think, Tara? <laughs> uh, I think that they can be seen as important because you can actually see the artist singing. Uh, but personally, I don't think they are that important because I more want to see the visuals in the music video and if I wanted to see them sing I'd see, them, see them live. live. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you think it's important to use effects in music videos? Um, I think they can be seen important mainly depending on the song because if it's can is it if it's a sad song or a slow song they can be seen as unnecessary but uh, they could be seen as useful and make some cool visuals if it's a good upbeat song. Would you like to add to that, Callum? Uh, I think she's covered. <laughs> Thanks, Callum. Why do you think it's important to use different angles in a music video? To show the artist's perspective, maybe, if it's the angle from their point of view, and it mm. shows many different other Meanings. perspectives. Yeah. yeah, and if it, like, if it's close up, you're sort of promoting the image of the artist better by having close ups. For example, in like um, Justin Bieber's video, you'd see variety close ups of his face, him like made up to look good for um, the target audience. Why do you think camera movements are used in <coughs> music videos? Um, the camera movement, I reckon, is like quite quick. Um, it if can the show. song is fast paced, yeah. then you'd use fast paced movements. You could correlate to movements, speed. But, um, if it's a slow song, it would be slow camera movements, I think. In your opinion, why do you think multi image can be successful in music video? Uh, I feel it's quite um, useful because you can get like more camera angles in by having, like, for example, like a split screen. Um, there's more things for the audience and the viewer. Uh, to look at in the music video. So you want more than one scenario or scene at a time. Yeah, cause, so it can like show like a little, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. A little, yeah. A little... You want to uh, add to that? I, I was, I was going to add to it, but I don't know what the word was. Like a little, um, deep, meaningful. Okay, thank you.